Yellowstone's markings indicate intent to erupt Ogden as experts investigate the big one. Yellowstone Volcano fully intends to erupt again, according to a documentary that identifies signs of the supervolcano's power that are still visible today. And the National Geographic documentary, America's National Parks claims it one day. The narrator said, the summer days pass too quickly here. Yellowstone's in study in contrast. This part of the Rocky Mountains is ancient, about 75 million years old. But the steaming plains are constantly being reborn thanks to the boiling supervolcano below. Here, the guts of the planet are very close to the surface. The series, which was shared on its YouTube channel last month, continues to identify what it believes are clues that another super eruption could be occurring. He added, The mud pots and fumaroles bubbling like red jets in the fountain-painted pot give the simplest clues to the power beneath. But 640,000 years ago, it exploded with the force of 1,000 atomic bombs. And the geyser reminds us that it fully intends to explode again. Some say it's too late. Scientists fear that when steamboat geyser suddenly erupts, spewing steam, mud, sand and rock into the water, it could be a sign of volcanic activity under Yellowstone. After a three and a half year nap, the inactive geyser erupted 32 times in 2018, a record 48 times in 2019 and 48 times in 2020. But a new study, published in the journal Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences, concludes that frequent steamboat activity does not trigger volcanic explosions. The Yellowstone supervolcano hasn't had a major eruption in 70,000 years, but scientists are constantly looking for clues to when the next big one might occur. And while Steamboat Geyser has come back to life, scientists think its sudden activity didn't coincide with the subterranean magma movements often seen before volcanic eruptions. Study author Michael Manga said, We found no evidence that there will be a major volcanic eruption.